you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Video Guide. And today, I got my final house for a game. I'm on game 49. I'm going to play 50th for the video, and then I'm going to show you guys the reward at the end. So you guys can get a little gameplay here. You guys are gonna get the the player I get. I'm gonna go over which ones I want, and then we're gonna to, maybe I'll probably do it in a sense where I'll check through my lineup for it. I'm not gonna I'm gonna close my eyes when I do it. Probably how I'm gonna work around this, guys. But if you're new to the channel, make sure to go down below and smash the sub button, guys. We're so close to 6k. By the time you guys see this, we should be even closer. So hopefully you guys can push me over the top in this video. Let's keep this grind going to 10k, guys. I really appreciate all the support. Also, guys, turn on the noti bell to get notified every time I post a brand new video. We're at like 1.2k noti gang, so let's get that up to 2k within the next week or two. I'd greatly appreciate it, guys. Also, let's get this video to 300 likes. You guys have been smashing the like button lately. I have no doubt you guys can do it. So I'd greatly appreciate that. Thank you guys so much for all the support lately. Comment down below who you think I'm going to get right now and when I'm about to do it, guys. So let's get into this game and start playing this head-to-head. -head. Let's get this going. Hopefully, I can win this game right away. We won't have an issue. Hey, real quick, guys. Just looking at the lineup real quick, what I could use. I know I was telling you guys before, but I want to show you guys the lineup. Zach Ertz could definitely play behind George Kittle. I do have a lot of tight end sets where Travis Kelce comes in and Greg Olson. It's kind of frustrating because they can never catch. Um, Mahomes, I guess I could take Mahomes so I could sell this one, but again, I don't want him permanently on my team, so that means I'll have to get rid of him at a point. I really don't want to do that. I want someone with a lot more value that could be on my team for a while, so hopefully it's not Mahomes. Hopefully it's not Todd Gurley. Todd Gurley would kind of piss me off because I already have Marcus Allen and I won't be using him. He could play backup, but I'd much rather have Lindsay than Mo. I'd rather have another player and Lindsay as my backup than Todd Gurley there. Wide receiver, I would love Odell. He'd take over Tyreek Hill's spot probably, or I'd put Torrey Holt in the slot and put Odell on the outside, so I don't really mind that at all. Now, coming in over on defense, just don't give me Gilmore. If I don't get Gilmore, that's perfectly fine. I'll be very happy without Gilmore. Oh, no lighting there. My bad. I'll be very happy without Gilmore because I have him already. And if I get him again, I'll be very, very angry because that's kind of a waste. And they only sell for like 1,000 training, maybe 900. So, that'll be very, very annoying. I don't want Harrison Smith. Like, Gilmore and Harrison Smith are the two I just don't want. Just don't give me those because I can't use them. Harrison Smith is not that good. I don't really care what his stats say. His speed's too slow for me at this point in the game. I love Ken Houston. He's overpowered. I would definitely take Keekly as a backup to Bobby Wagner, and I'd, I'd love D-Law. I'd love D-Law, I'd love Keekly, and I'd love Odell. Those are the three I preferably want. Just no Gilmore, no Harrison Smith, and for the most part, I'll be happy with everything else, guys. All right, let's get into the game. If I lose it, guys, I'm going to be really upset because then i got to do another one, but it's all good, guys. Let's get into this game. All right, guys, so we're getting into this game. Top three, I see Byron, Ryan Chase. Yeah, that should be my team. This guy's got Luck, D-Hop, Malcolm Brown. Top three is so messed up, so I can't even rely on that. But again, these games don't really come down to who has the best team for the most part. It comes down to who can get the best money play going into it. So I'm not really too concerned about what the best top three is. So we're coming down on defense, which I kind of like to be most. I kind of like that the most part, to be honest with you guys. I like coming out on defense. Coming out on offense is cool, but then if you mess up or anything, it's time you got to kind of quit. At least if they score first, I know I can still go for two. So let's see. This guy looks like he's going to run to the left. I have a horrible run defense out here. Can't really do much about that at this point. Pinch this. Yep, it's gonna be a stretch to the left. I had a feeling it was gonna be like that. All right, we can stop Marks Allen there. All right, let's see what he's gonna do. I mean, again, it looks like he's gonna run the ball, but he could also. I mean, he should probably be passing it here. So if I can stop the run again. Now he's going to the right. We got him locked up. But Khalil? No, that's not Khalil. Who is that? 27. I don't really know who that is. Who's 27? Oh, it's Ken, okay. It's Ken Houston. Probably should have realized by the bucket helmet. Kind of like a dead give. Wow, this guy's really coming out here running it. Come on, get him down. Fumble shoes in this. You can force a fumble. It's pretty much game over for the most part. All right. I'm just going to run it again. I mean, I'm just going to run commit. Yeah, I ran commit. Get him down. Nice, nice. We got him down. Whew. Come out and cover three again. Pinch this. Come out here. I'm going to be using Ken Houston here. In case he runs it. Can play some runs for you. He's always going to be passing it. Oh my god, I wish we would have dropped it. Dropping it is huge right now without there's like minimal downs. I win most of my games like that. I forced a drop. I'm run committing left. I know he's gonna run it. Yep. Yes, I stopped him. Fourth down. Whew. User in Ken Houston was huge there. Hopefully he goes for the field goal, because if he goes for the field goal, I'm pretty confident I could just win this game with a touchdown. Let's see what he's gonna do. I think I'm gonna come out and goal line. I'm gonna come on and go line. I know he's gonna run the ball. Still got my man coverage here just in case he doesn't. Come on. No, damn it. Wow, damn, he got in there. 
All right, hopefully it doesn't go. Okay, he's not going for two, so I just have to go for two and try to win this game. It's kind of annoying, but we'll we'll make it work. We'll make it work. We definitely will. It's looking like a good run play. It's looking like we can get it going. Okay, there we go. All right, we just gotta we gotta go for two. Definitely gotta go for two. I'm gonna try to pass the ball. I know you guys want to see what I run, so I'm just gonna kind of not uncut the offense part of it. Give you guys a good idea. Max protect with Kelsey. All right, let's see what we can do here. Oh, game -o. That's game. Got him right there. Okay, I gotta, I gotta go for two here. Whew. I told you guys I definitely do not want to go into OT. OT in here is very, very annoying because it starts you guys all over again. It's kind of kind of very frustrating. Okay, stack in the box. See if you can break this outside with Marcus Allen. And that's the game, guys. We're going to get our free player. That was very simple. Like I said, they stack on that two point. You just pitch it outside. As long as that first guy doesn't get the shed, you should be fine. Marcus Allen's too fast. He'll beat everyone to the edge. It's not bad at all. Okay, so that should be our final game. Hopefully it counts. I've had a few issues where a few games haven't counted, but again, it could just be because it desyncs and disconnected. And I think sometimes it doesn't properly track it. All right, guys, we're going to go back into the main menu. Let's get our pack. Okay, so we're loading back in, guys. Okay, so there we go. There's our one of one wins, as much as that tries to track it. There's our, there's our 50 player. I'm not going to open it yet. Okay, so let's go over who I kind of want here. So there's eight players. I'm going to go to the... Hmm. Go right here. So I got much superstars. Let's go. There's Odell. There's Todd Gurley, Zach Ertz, Luke Keekley, D. Law, Harrison Smith, Mahomes, and Gilmore. Who I don't want is Gilmore. I mean, honestly, that's the worst one because I have him already. If I get Gilmore, I'll be very upset. I'm gonna have to quick sell him. Or honestly, the best bet would probably be to hold him for the next series. That'd probably be an exchange set for them. Not so much them, but you can exchange it for an 88. You know, like the elite player exchange. You could probably exchange an 88 or 89 for a 90 overall. So let's hope that comes out next series. So in case I get him. Now, if I had to get anyone else, I mean, I don't really want Mahomes, but I will take him because I could sell my Mahomes for 400k, but I really don't want a quarterback. I don't want Harrison Smith at all because I have, I can have Ken Houston, and he's so slow. Please don't give me a Harrison Smith. Who I'll take? I'll take D-Law and Luke Keekle. I'll be very excited about. I can sell Reggie White, or I can sell Bobby Wagner. Todd Gurley, I'll be very upset about because I have Mark Allen, but I guess I could use a backup running back, and I'll just give it to Lindsey, although he isn't that. It will be very annoying. Odell, I would love. Zach Ertz I'll be upset about, but again, I could use a backup tight end with uh because I do run two tight end sets all the time, so I'll have Kittle and Zach Ertz. That won't be the end of the world. But I will not be the most excited about Ertz. Definitely Odell, Keekley, and D Law is what I'm aiming for. I could definitely take my home. Just don't give me Gilmore. I mean anything other than Gilmore, and I won't be too pissed off. I just really hope it's not gonna be oh, come on, please. D Law will be a starter, Keekley will be a starter, Ertz will be a starter, Odell will be a starter, Mahomes will be a starter. Just don't give me Gilmore. Okay, let's go open this pack. I'm probably going to close my eyes because I like going through the lineup. Okay. Comment down below right now, guys. What do you think I'm going to get? Comment down below. Okay. Don't comment down below. Stefan Gilmore, that'll be messed up. Comment down below what you think I'm going to get. Okay, guys, I'm opening it. I'm going to look away. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. You know, it's open. Is it open? Okay. I have a feeling like it was Stefan Gilmore. I have a feeling like it was Gilmore. I really hope it isn't. Okay, let's go into the team. I like to do it like this one by one. So we got... Let's go to quarterback. Was it Mahomes? It was not Mahomes. Okay. I don't want it to be Gurley, so I'm not opening up Gurley yet. Please be Odell Beckham Jr. Please be Odell Beckham Jr. It was not Odell Beckham Jr. Oh, God. Was it top? I feel like it was Gilmore. I feel like it was. I have a feeling. It was not. Oh, God. Okay, I'll take Zach Ertz. Give me Ertz. Give me Ertz. Do not give me Gilmore. Oh, my God. If it was Gilmore, I'll be pissed. Luke Keekley, B. Keekley, come on. Oh no. Oh no, I'm getting upset. D Law. B. D. Law, please be D. Law, please be D. Law. Thank the Lord! We got the Marcus Lawrence. I'm hyped. That's actually amazing. He's, oh, he's overpowered left end right now with all his abilities. Oh God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you. If that was. If that was Stefan, I was down to three players. There was Harrison Smith, there was Stefan Gilmore and D Law. Thank you for giving me D Law. I'll gladly put him on the D line, right next to where Reggie White is. I'll get, I'll sell Reggie White, make a ton of coins back on him. Ooh, my heart was pounding right there. I really thought, I really thought I got Gilmore. I don't know why. I saw the corner of my eye. I saw the color scheme. I saw like a, ooh, okay. I can relax now. That's awesome, guys. We got D Law. So I'm going to be selling Reggie White. I'm going to be putting the team together. Probably get Lawrence Taylor soon. I'll probably do a lineup update when all is said and done after Weekend League Rewards. If you guys haven't seen my last video, I did post a trophy video. So go back there and go check it out. I posted it earlier this morning. It's very useful if you haven't gotten your house rules win yet. 
at 2.30, there is Weekend League rewards, so, or 2 o'clock, so I will be posting my video around 2.33 for the Weekend League Top 100 rewards, guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys have been enjoying the content. My heart's racing. I really thought I got Gilmore. I would have screamed. Okay, so D-Law's good. I'm happy. That was one of the three I wanted. I wanted Keekly, D-Law, or Odell. That was not bad at all. Gladly take that. Guys, if you're new to the channel, smash the sub button. Let's get to 6K subs after this video. I think this will push us over the top. Turn on the Noti Bell button to get notified every time I post a brand new video, guys. Comment down below if you guys think I got a good pull and who you guys got out of these. I'd love to know who you guys got. I know I heard a lot of people were getting Ertz and Harrison Smith. Also, let's get this video to 300 likes. Smash the like button, guys. And that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed. I'm out. Peace.